So we're in beautiful Niagara Falls, Ontario at the immaculate Skyline Tower with starting middle linebacker for the Western Mustangs, John Serlum. What was the recruiting experience like? Because I know Coach Marshall came and spoke to mom and dad and it was a group decision. It wasn't just yours. What was that experience like for you guys? Um, you know, it was a lot, and they can contest to that, that, you know, we had recruiters calling, um, you know, two, three times a night, and it would all be different schools, and, you know, sometimes I would look to my mom and be like, you know, maybe you should answer the phone, oh, yeah. and, you know, she, so she, she kind of got sick of that, but it all came down to it, uh, Coach Marshall came down for a visit, sat and talked with them, and, you know, he, everything that he promised, he kind of fulfilled, and my dad can attest to that. He asked John, what does it take to make you come to Western University? And he looked at me and I said, don't ask me, it's up to John. But uh, basically, uh, like John has said, everything he promised, he said he'd do, he'd take, would take care of him, and everything else, he did. And to this day, he still does, and he takes care of John Serla. So to this day, I'm personally happy with John's hard work and everything's taking place. Second game, you kind of decided, listen, I'm going to be the middle linebacker for the Western Mustangs for a long, long time. Western with the pickoff, and it's Serla, their youngster, a first-year man out of Niagara Falls, gives it right on back to the Falls offense. Huge play by John Serla. Well, when I was given the opportunity week two, I just, I ran with it. You know, I, one, a coach told me one time, you know, um, success comes when opportunity meets preparedness. And at that moment in time during that McMaster game, I hit it perfectly. Serla steps up and makes a fantastic play from the linebacking spot. This is a guy just built and born and bred to play the linebacker position. This OUA feature is brought to you by Wilson, the official football of the OUA.